Okay. Got it. Yeah, it's Sandy Murray here, and welcome to uh, Listen Carefully, the Training and Marketing Network show. Uh, today, my guest is Sherry Bennett, and I'm really pleased to have her with me today. Sherry is an educator on medical cannabis. So Sherry, do you mind introducing yourself, telling us a little bit about yourself, maybe what you do? Yeah, hi, Sandy. and and. Thank you so very much for inviting me on your show. Uh, I'm truly honored. Um, so yes, my name is Sherry Bennett and I am a medical cannabis educator and resource consultant. I, I help people get uh, safe access to cannabis medicine and, uh, and educate them along the way. Uh, that's, that's it in a nutshell, really. Um, uh, yeah. Yeah, I'd like you to ask me questions if you'd like, and then I can continue. Yeah, the like the question I have for today is because, yeah. as I said, my my thing is training, marketing, and networking. Right. And today, I kind of like uh, under my pillar of training. Uh, mm -hmm. You know, uh, you know what is it today that you're going to be covering with us? Is it oh, related so, yeah. to training? I'm glad, yes, I'm glad you mentioned that because um, I've just launched brand new uh, patient educator training. You know, if, if one wants to switch careers, for instance, and learn how to, to uh, you know, assist physicians and nurse practitioners, those who, who prescribe uh, cannabis, uh, and those people who really, uh, really don't have a, a good understanding of how to to dose it themselves. So this training is, uh, is ideal actually for, for people that do want to change careers or for people that, uh, that, that don't know very much about cannabis. Or I was thinking the other day for doctors who already have like an existing clinic or an existing practice, this training could um, help them, you know, if they wanted to open up a cannabis clinic. And we know they are opening up everywhere across Canada here where we are. And, um, and, and it's very soon, uh, Thailand just opened up. Thailand just became uh, a legal country. Uh, so uh, the, it's, it's really exciting. Uh, uh, it's, it's very exciting actually, because um, I have courses that nobody knows about yet. So, wow, that's fantastic. Yeah, it, it's exciting. It really so this is. is sort of like a, a launch of, of that training. Is it just one course or several? No, we have, we have two now. We have one <clears throat> called the Foundations of Medical Cannabis. And that goes and tells us about the history of prohibition and, and, uh, and really uh, different types of cannabis. And also uh, it talks about the human endocannabinoid system and how every single human being on this planet has, makes their own cannabis molecules. That's the easiest way I can describe it. And that's why this plant medicine works so well with um, so many different conditions, uh, you know, human conditions. From Basically- your, Oh, sorry, yeah. go ahead. No, I was just saying, both, uh, most of my clients, I've been helping people like who, who live with arthritis, for instance, or, um, or anxiety, uh, sleep disruption. And, and, and those of us that live with symptoms of post-trauma, post-traumatic stress, uh, we get significant results from cannabis. And, uh, and we have the evidence now. So uh, I'm really excited to share it because I spent the last six years or so uh, studying the medical science and also, I've, I've been taking uh, medical cannabis every day since, uh, like I said, with, uh, with significant results. So, and we also know, I'd like to point out that cannabis does not come with the risk of life-threatening addiction or lethal overdose. You know, unlike opioid medications, uh, frankly. So uh, they're, they're, very, they're very scary and, and you know, well-meaning doctors now are prescribing uh, antidepressants and sleeping pills because 
frankly, our world is in <laughs> a bit of distress right now. You know, this pandemic has fueled, uh, it has fueled domestic violence and racism and and the opioid crisis is 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 becoming uh, out of control. It's growing rapidly, and and it's uh, so this this is exciting to me. This knowledge uh, and the fact that cannabis is now becoming the spotlight uh, in the world. Uh, it never really should have been prohibited in the first place, but we know now that it is uh, effective necessary i would even go so far as to say it's a necessary medicine uh oh. for for certain people okay certain so, yeah. so so in summary there can you just summarize what problem cannabis solves from your perspective well it, it minimizes suffering and and death for instance you know because people uh it does not it, like there's no way one can die from an overdose of cannabis is just not possible. And that's what we learn in this course. We learn how uh, you know, the cannabis it interacts with our own human endocannabinoid system. And it's, it's, I know it's a, a long word and hard to pronounce, but this system, this endocannabinoid system was just discovered in 1988. And be because of the laws, because it is prohibited in so many countries. It is not yet taught in med schools. So most medical doctors don't even have this information yet. It's not their fault. It's just that they're not taught this in med schools. So uh, there's a lot of doctors now that are coming and getting self-educated and learning about this system. And uh, of course, that has a very positive effect on their patients, helps their patients. So when they is, have that knowledge. It, is the course uh, delivered online? Is it what you call computer-based or self-paced? Yeah, it's, um, yes, it's uh, self-paced actually. It's one could take it online and uh, in the privacy of their own home. And uh, yeah, I think they, we give a people about a month to complete it, but uh, we get a certificate at the end and it is um, packed with information and knowledge and uh and so are the are the courses here's a tough question for you everybody yeah, likes mm -hmm. to, to know yeah. this is how much does it cost oh the, the the first one foundations of medical cannabis is uh i'm pretty sure it's the 297 us wow and, that's that's really reasonable well for this this high level education i would say too and and the second one is, uh, I think, about seven hundred dollars U.S. I'm not, I'm not entirely sure, but uh, I once again, I think that's huge value, given that the course was created by a medical doctor, and uh, with a lot of experience in cannabinoid medicine and working in cannabis clinics, and actually, I was, I edited them too, so I understand the uh, the content. So I'm I'm really excited about it. It's 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 like I said, it's something that uh, a lot of people don't know about yet. So no, I I what I sensed is that uh, that's very reasonable pricing. And what I did is I just compared it. If I was to have to go to a community college for it, or if I had to, you know, I might pay three or four thousand dollars for a course of that nature. If I even went to a university. Type right. of thing. Is it available offline? No, this is not available offline. It's only on my website, uh, letstalkcannabis.ca. So okay. we, po we posted it there. So that's what I was, that was my next question, sort of to wrap this up is, so uh, if someone wants to find out more about your courses, where can they find that information? Yes, yeah, so you go to my website, letstalkcannabis.ca, and you click on, it's on the front page, online courses, right on the front page there, and you'll see. And if you want to dig a little deeper into the website, there's a lot of really good articles and education uh, in the form of blog articles and, and even media posts, too, and, and podcasts. I'll be posting our podcast uh, interviews on there too. I just I've got to mention 
very recently, I was interviewed by Miguel Torres, and he has a podcast called The Conversation, Cannabis and Christianity. So it's really a fascinating uh, podcast because I've, I've listened to every single one of his episodes, and we learn something from each and every guest that he has. And he has had uh, cannabis doctors and lawyers and um, people in uh, veterans, people in the US uh, Navy. Uh, we have so many really, really interesting people and, um, and those in the indigenous community that are doing really wonderful things, uh, you know, with cannabis. So can I get to that podcast from your website? Yes, if we look at the media page, yeah. Uh, let's talk cannabis.ca and then you click on the media section and, and you'll find that there. So that's too. that's really two calls to action. You can get the detailed information about the courses, as you said, and you can also get involved in listening to more, we'll say, expertise on a unique podcast. Would that yes. be right? Yes, that's right. And I would say it is unique. I would say it is unique. And, uh, and it is wonderful. And I, I just look forward to every Wednesday, you know, every Wednesday he, he has a new, uh, a new guest. And uh, yeah, we learned something from each and every one. Okay, that's fantastic. I think we're gonna wrap it up here, unless you have a final comment you wanna make. Uh, no, thank you so much for this opportunity. And uh, let's all just um, think about about stretching our intelligence and let's think about the things that we may have been taught over the years that have been proven to be wrong. So my final comment is let's talk cannabis. Beautiful. Thank you Thank very you. much. Uh, pleasure mm -hmm. uh, chatting with you today. Great information you shared today and certainly uh, we'll be uh, chatting with you again, maybe on, on another topic at another time. Thank you so very much, Sandy Murray. Thank okay, you. Okay, bye for now. Bye for now.